Hello and welcome to ExcelMasterSeries.com. Today we're going to show how to use the uniform distribution to solve problems and we're going to do it in Excel. So let's take a look at our Excel spreadsheet. We'd like to get rid of the grid lines, so hit Tools, Options, then uncheck the checkbox next to Grid Lines, hit OK, the grid lines are gone. Now, a variable is uniformly distributed if all possible outcomes of that variable have an equal probability of occurring, like each possible outcome of the roll of a fair die. And the uniform distribution is a discrete distribution, not continuous. Now let's take a look at a typical problem involving the uniform distribution. Fair die is rolled once. What's the probability that either a 2 or a 5 will appear on top after the roll? Well, here's how we do it. Well, the number of total possible outcomes in one trial is 6, so n equals 6. And the number of times that a 2 or a 5 can appear as a possible outcome is 1. So a for 2 equals 1, b for 5 equals 1. And the probability of a 2 equals the probability of a 5. That's one-sixth for each one of those. So the probability of two or probability of five equals probability of two plus probability of five, or is equivalent to plus. That equals one-sixth plus one-sixth equals one-third. So there's a 33% probability that a two or a five will appear in one roll of a fair die. Now let's take a look at an Excel chart that we've made to show the uniform distribution in this problem. And we see the uniform distribution is a discrete distribution. It has y values only at specific x values. Each one of those have the same value, one-sixth for each point. If you would like to master MBA level statistics in Excel, check out our Excel Statistical Master series of emanuals at www.excelmasterseries.com slash emanual.php. Thank you very much and goodbye.